Josh. And Allison Xanthopoulos, Communications Coordinator. And we have some big and exciting news to share with you all that is going to affect our in-person worship services starting this Sunday. Uh, with the changes from the CDC related to COVID-19, our bishop has moved to make some changes within the Virginia Conference. Uh, we're going to be changing some of the rules uh, as we move forward into summer. Uh, these are going to be centered around members of the church that are fully vaccinated. And the definition that the CDC and that the conference are using to define uh, those that are fully vaccinated are people that are two weeks out either from their second shot of the Pfizer or Moderna vaccine or people that are two weeks out from their one vaccine of the Johnson & Johnson. That's right, Pastor Josh. And uh, let, let's talk about what um, we can expect to see inside. Yes, so for the inside services, the big change is that singing is allowed inside with a mask if you are fully vaccinated. Now, it's important to know that we uh, will not be requiring any proof of vaccination and that uh, we are gonna be relying on the honor system. Uh, as we strive to make worship hospitable and inclusive uh, for all persons, regardless of their vaccination status. That's right. Um, and what about outside? What, how about those uh, outdoor green services? Yes, so for the outdoor services, we will be able to continue to sing with our masks on. Uh, the big change that's coming to the outdoor services is that fully vaccinated persons may now be unmasked in the outdoor worship settings except while we are singing uh, and when you are uh, properly distanced from one another so i know that this is this is exciting it's super exciting so again uh, these changes are related to to singing now we can sing inside with masks uh, we can continue to sing outside with masks and for the outside service, if you are fully vaccinated, you can be unmasked uh, except when we sing. That's right. So we hope you will uh, come and join us and um, take part in this exciting opportunity. Yes, if you're interested in some more information related to the conference's changes to the worship service, uh, the conference has released a, a news release that can be found on the conference website. There is also a recording of a um, webinar from Monday um, that can be found on the conference's Facebook page. We hope to see you in worship this weekend.